The reason why I know they're a perfect couple and why I know Carson is perfect for Francis is a few months into their relationship, we're at a party. After a few drinks, Francis gets up to get a drink of water and Carson's sitting on the couch and he drapes himself across the couch as Francis walks away and he goes, I'm gonna wife that chick. And I'm like, okay. And he's like, no, I promise you, I'm gonna wife that chick. And I'm like, okay. So here we are three and a half years later and he has wifed that chick. <laughs> Woo! Holding on through all the years Looking back brings me to tears Oh, I want to see this through All I know is how I feel And all I want is what is real Today, in front of all our friends and family, I'm going to tell you something you don't and won't often hear me freely admit. You were right. <laughs> Nothing serious, I said. And now I'm standing here in a very fluffy white dress on a beautiful se Saturday evening in September, marrying you. I've never been happier to be proven wrong. Francis, I don't think anyone ever said that life would be easy, but nothing worth having is ever easy. We've had hardship, we have had success, and we have had everything in between. I can never tell you what we will have next, but I can tell you that I love you with all my heart. I vow to love you. I don't think you ever needed me in your life. And sometimes I might have been more trouble than I was worth. Despite all of that we've been through, you've chosen me to be the one that you love. And I'll fight for that love each and every day. Today I commit to a lifetime of giant dogs, terrible puns, and down the line some really stubborn kids. <laughs> Today and until my last day, I give you my word, my hand, and my heart. Let's go have an adventure. So I raise a toast to the happy couple. May they never regret and always learn. May they always roll a critical hit. And may they have more friends than their home can hold, no matter how big it is. Cheers. Howard, you may seal your marriage with a kiss. Oh.